it comes around so often anymore my head just spins we're doing current favorites today stick with me we're gonna see what i loved and what i didn't love so much Hi friends, I appreciate you joining me for a few minutes today. As always, I will show you my shirt. I'll try to throw up a picture here. I will show you the earrings. I'm actually really in love with these little cute earrings. These are definite favorite of mine. They're a two layer little tiny uh, butterfly here and then down and then they have this long gold chain on them or uh, I don't know what they're called, little tassels I guess on them. I think they're so cute. I just have fallen in love with them. So that is a definite love for the month. Before we get started, I wanna let you know that I use a numbering system as I go through my products. And it's so much easier for you, I find. Each product will be numbered, one through however many products we have here today. And then you can take and jot down that number of the product instead of having to write the entire product out. Jot, now, jot down the number of that product and then open up the description box Everything is listed and linked below and numbered. Let's say that you love to see a lipstick I showed and that lipstick is number 15 for products. So you just jot down 15, you go down into the description, click on the link, it'll take you directly to that. And those links, of course, are my affiliate links and I do appreciate it when you shop those so much because it does support my channel and I get to keep going. So I do appreciate that, thank you so much. So let's just start, let's say that the shirt was number one, the earrings were number two as far as that goes let's make sure that we number those loving those cute little earrings and then i have been absolutely loving these sandals we are getting into sandal weather and i have problems wearing sandals but these have some really nice cushion on them and they don't have the flip-flop little thong part right here that we use to kill the middle of our toe on I have a problem with those sometimes. Sometimes I can wear some, sometimes I can't. But these are just regular sandals. I love the little bling on them. They're so, so cute. And they come in a bunch of different colors and been loving these and been loving wearing them when it's a little bit warmer. Not too warm at my house yet, but we're getting there. And then I also wanna show you this purse. I showed several purses this time on my channel and you all seem to really like that. I adore this purse. I don't think I've ever shown this before. This has so much cute, cute detail on it. It is a definite sage green color and it looks very textured on the leather. I don't know if you can see that very well or not. It does have a zipper pocket on the back of it and then the two straps over the top of it. I'll show a large picture of it or it's on somebody for you it does have two pockets right here that you can unzip and then it does have the side pockets that actually unzip and then they also clip so you have lots of pockets there and the different tassels and everything on this i just thought this was such a cute purse and then inside it does have several different compartments a little bit hard to see but i will make sure that i link it for you so that you can see it more in depth i would say that it's kind of medium large it's not really large because some of my large ones are really large so yeah this one is great i've loved using it um i'm currently using that purple one that you saw the other day but definitely wanted to show you that one as well. Let's talk a little bit about hair products. I have a lot of hair products. In my Sephora video where I did 25 products under $20, I introduced these that I had never used before. And it's the Ordinary Hair Color. There is the Sulfate Cleanser, and you can use this for your body or your hair. And then there is the uh, I can't even say that. So this is the conditioner. <laughs> I love both of these. The conditioner makes my hair so soft and the cleanser isn't like a shampoo and they definitely did not put shampoo on the label for a reason. This does not lather up like a regular shampoo, but it really gets your hair clean, really gets your scalp clean as well. I really think that this is fantastic. And then I also introduced you to the Inky List Peptide Volumizing Hair Treatment. This is amazing for helping the diameter of your hair plump up and making your hair feel thicker. My hair on a normal day when I don't use this, I just let my hair air dry, don't 
do anything with it when I'm out of the shower. It really has no life to it, but this makes it so much thicker and it has the peptides in it. So you're actually getting a great treatment for your hair. That's what I like about the ordinary as well. You're getting treatment for your hair, not just the standard shampoo, conditioner, and a styling product. So I really love all three of these. Um, I wanted to definitely report back to you on those because I had put those in that video before. So really like those. And then this is a treatment. This is the Provana, the Perfect Blonde Hair Mask. And this is super purple. This is how I keep the brassies out of my hair. Now I need to use it again, obviously right now, but I usually use this maybe every other week as a mask that I will leave on for about 10 minutes and then I'll rinse it off. This is beautiful for toning your hair down and giving it a very cool tone. It's just a great mask. It lasts a long time because it's quite thick and it is also very conditioning and I really love this. It's something that I have talked about many times, but I haven't talked about it for a long time. And I wanted to talk about it because it has been, it does make a huge difference in your hair, especially as we go into summer and our hair seems to get a little bit more brassy with the sun. Mine does anyway. I don't know about you guys. This one right here, I'm really excited to tell you about. I've been holding off telling you about this. I actually found this product just by chance. I don't remember whether it was on Instagram or Facebook where you get the ads, right? Well, my hair has been thinning ever since I hit menopause. It's just been super duper thinning. And I just have had so much hair loss and I've just been really freaked out about it. Even the minoxidil that I used to show you guys um, that I got from Kirkland, it just doesn't work the way it used to. By the way, I purchased this all on my own. This is not sponsored. This is just my experience with it from purchasing it. DS Laboratories Spectral DNC-N Redensifying Hair Therapy. It says it restores, stimulates, and revitalizes. Okay, I use this on the nights before I know I'm going to wash my hair the next day. I use quite a lot of it because you're supposed to use it morning and night. I don't do that because I am somebody that uses a lot of hair care products and, you know, mousse and conditioners, leave-in conditioners, that kind of thing, dry shampoo. And I don't want to have to go in and wash my hair every day. So every other night I will use this on my scalp and I have one of those massagers, those silicone massagers that you can use for your hair. I'll link one of those down below if you don't know what I'm talking about. So I use those as well. This finally after such a long time my hair has stopped falling out now i do have those hairs that you get when you wash your hair i have a few of those and i'm not saying i never lose a hair every day but i'm not i i kid you not i was counting yes i know count the hairs that you lose but i was losing so many that i was freaking out so i was i was losing like 300 to 400 hairs a day you're only supposed to lose 100 hairs a day so they say this has finally slowed that down. It's also supposed to really help condition your hair and it's supposed to help thicken it or make the hair that, you, that you're growing to be thicker. I can finally report after using this, this is my third bottle. And so I've been using this probably for four months. This is really working well, so well that I bought another product from them that I'll be testing that I have, I'm not gonna bring to you yet, but I'll be testing it. I finally feel like my hair is starting to redensify again. I have all kinds and I have to kind of smooth them down with hairspray. I have all kinds of little spiky hairs. This hair up here, my hair used to go back all the way almost to the crown of my head there are hairs that are starting in there again and i'm so excited about it i have when i curl my hair i have little hair sticking up because i have new hair everywhere this is really good you can purchase this out off of amazon which i think is great but you can go onto their website and get a subscription for it as well one bottle will last me a couple months because i don't really you know use it like you're they say to use it i bet if you use this every day morning and night your hair would grow like a weed i i bet it would because I just don't want to have to wash my hair that often. And if you don't use hair products, you won't care about this because it isn't like minoxidil. It doesn't make your hair super greasy. It just, it adheres to what I already have in my hair for products. And that's the only thing that I find about it. But wow, this is so good. I would really recommend it. And I'm really excited that I tried it. Okay, for a few fails. First of all, there is an undone lip liner. 
this is so weird because it's more of lip liquid pencils and i don't like these um i don't like the way that they apply um, i cannot possibly use this end which is supposed to be the one you line with and get a decent line out of it because it is that liquid and it is the pencil and or it is the felt tip and i just i can't use that and then the colors aren't that great either um, it's supposed to be lip staining there is a neutral that turns very orange and then this one turns very hot pink so that's hard for me and that's not something that i enjoyed and then physicians formula came out with their whole new line this is their one that is their um the highlighter first of all this is much too orange for me i can't use it the bronzers are very very orange i can't use those either but when i put down in here my brush there was so much powder kick up it was like it was supposed to be a pressed powder but it hadn't been pressed enough so it just became a loose powder and it went everywhere you don't need a lot of it and if you're somebody that's okay with that tons and tons of fallout then go for it but i being so fair if i go into any products i have to be very careful so if i dip into this with a brush I've got to make sure that I'm tapping, tapping, or, you know, patting it into my hand or a rag or something. So I didn't appreciate the color, way too orange, and I didn't like their bronzer either. I do like their new powder and I do like their new blushes. By the way, these were sent to me. So just so you know, I'm always very honest about this kind of stuff, whether it's sent to me or not. These two were not sent to me. This first one is the new NYX Shine Loud lip it has a duo liquid lip on one side and then the gloss on the other side and so that one is new to me and then these are brand new from maybelline these are their vinyl lipsticks okay both of these do the exact same thing and i'll tell you why i don't like them they never feel comfortable on my lips i always feel like i've got something super duper sticky on my lips and that feeling where your lips kind of get stuck together even as you're talking and if you ever, you know, press your lips together, you can feel how sticky that is. Almost like you've got honey or sugar or something very sticky on your lips. Not for me. I can't do it. It's just, no, no, no. I just can't do it. So those are a big no. But I did go and pick up some of the Rimmel Stay Glossy Lip Glosses. And I forgot how much I love these. These are so good. I just cannot believe how much I love these again. And let me just put one of them on for you. Super duper shiny. They're, they've got a very sheer texture to them. There's no um, like plumping or anything to them. Right now I can't smell much, but I don't think that they have any sort of a fragrance to them either. They're very light. They're the exact texture of gloss that I love and at a great price point. And they just make anything you put on your lips look more juicy and more yummy. And I really like them. I think they're great. I've got a nude one. I've got kind of a sparkly sheer one. I got a sparkly pink one. And then the one that I just showed you. So really have been loving those and they're not very much which i love as well sigma did send me their new color correctors and i am enjoying them so much i really love the texture of this if you're somebody that wants a, a color corrector you're wanting to use a color corrector you like a color corrector you're probably going to really like these now i used the medium dark one but they have the light one and they have the deep one and or i think it's it's light to dark. I don't remember. It's medium. Anyway, I use this one right here. And then this one's the light one. This one's the deep one. Great texture on these. Very emollient. And they just really work into the skin well. And they seem to stay there as I'm putting on top of them my concealer as long as i am sure to let this set down a little bit before i do go in with the concealer so i really like these they don't seem to make my concealer crease anymore i love a good color corrector it's one of those things that i really do like um but if you are interested in these just know that sigma always has great sales they have the the most fantastic sales all the time as a matter of fact this last week there was a 40 percent off sale I didn't get to it fast enough because it was only like a four hour thing, but they do have sales constantly. So get on their email list or just watch for when I'm posting on the community tab because I'm usually gonna post about that kind of thing. Now, I also want to recommend, and yes, they did send me this as well, but this is such a pretty powder. Now, I I got this and then I thought it was just a setting powder and then I was watching Glitzy Fritzy, my friend Mary, and she was using it, I think in a video just 
like a couple days ago. Anyway, she used this powder and this is, is like, um, it's like a glowy powder, like a finishing powder, not really a powder that is to set with although you can but it has just a tiny bit of glow to it i hope that you can that comes across on camera it reminds me very much of the lancome uh ooh, what is that called the lancome absolute powder that that i talk about all the time in absolute golden but this is such a fraction of the cost and it's a beautiful powder it they it doesn't come in a bunch of colors i don't believe i haven't checked into that yet if it does i'll correct myself here on the screen but i really really love this it's called the beaming glow illuminating powder i like this so much more than the laura mercier glow that one was like a highlighter you could use it for but this one is just beautiful for just you know the middle of your face where you want to just dust some light on it's just so pretty and then the last thing i also got on pr but i want to tell you about them koki came out with their ombre blushes moira did this first I have to say that Moira Beauty, they did this first and then Koki came out with them. Koki sent me all of them and they are beautiful. They seem to be very much like the Moira ones. They just are really close to the same ones. Now you can, you know, try to dip your brush down into like something like this if you're warmer or you can go into the pink. They're, they're really pretty. They're really, really pretty. I love working with them. It's a nice powder that does stick around for a long time. And I love the ombre effect on them. I think that the little um, embossing on there just elevates it a notch. And so for it being a product that is drugstore, it's very pretty. These blushes are highly saturated. So a little bit is going to go a long way, but you can see right, oh, I got something right there, but you can see right there that they are very, very beautiful. I think that they're a great value as far as the packaging and the product and how pretty they really truly are. But yeah, Moira did it first. Koki, I love you. I love you to death, but Moira did this first. So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of your time with me. I hope that you did enjoy seeing me add in a little bit of lifestyle as far as fashion goes into this. I'd like to do that a little bit more and more as I go along in my videos. So I hope that you're having a fantastic day. Please don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I am trying my hardest to get to 100,000 subscribers i've been on youtube for six years and i really really want to get to a hundred thousand and really get to that achievement because it is one of my goals for the beginning of the year so hopefully i can do that but even if i don't you guys know that i love what i do and i love all of you and thank you so much for all of your support please give the video a thumbs up on your way out of here i really appreciate that hope that you're all having a great day come back around very soon we'll be together in my next video take care of yourselves See you, my friends. Bye-bye.